been working on my daughter Scary the Snail costume, and I noticed his eyeballs were too tall. Maybe you would, you might disagree, but I lined up Gary the Snail with this current Gary, ignoring the shell. The eyeballs are too tall. Another fun fact about Gary is his eyeballs are green. I was surprised by that. I never really noticed until today, and I stared at Gary for far too many hours in my life. The first step in making one of these suits after I've crafted a shape out of some seat foam that I bought at the hobby store, like, you know, what you'd make, like, a seat cushion out of? That's probably not right, but that's what I use. I attached the accents, the dots, the swirls of a shell first, and then I lay the fabric over the whole entire design. Then I use scissors to mark where each of the, I don't know what you'd call them, embellishments are. That gives me a point of reference for when I cut the rest of it out. So now I'm following the swirl pattern, and I'm going to, like, 